Hey guys, this is Weibo and I have a small request. If you're watching my videos and if you like my videos, then please try to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon and hit likes. Uh, it will motivate me and it will make me aware to make more videos. To create uh, this highly uh, knowledgeable video, I have to study a lot and then I have to put all together and create a video. Please like those videos if you found them informative. On this note, let's begin this new video. Hello guys and welcome back. In this video, we are going to see what is VSX. VSX of Checkpoint Firewall. Full form of VSX is Virtual System Extension. A product that runs several virtual firewalls on same hardware. What that means, consider uh, you have a purchase a checkpoint firewall VSX gateway appliance with that appliance you will have a license facilities where you can have a multiple virtual firewall so within one hardware using one hardware you will be able to create a multiple virtual firewalls which we call virtual systems so virtual systems like that based on your license you will be having different virtual systems and these virtual systems short form is vs and full form is virtual systems can be act like a firewall so one virtual system is nothing but your one firewall so like that you can have a multiple virtual systems a multiple firewalls for multiple firewalling purpose basically each virtual system works as a security gateway or a firewall which typically protects your a separate network when packet arrives at the VSX gateway, so consider some packet arrives here, it send that particular packet to a respective virtual system with or whom who's protecting that virtual network. I mean, it sends that traffic to the virtual system protecting the destination networks so whatever the destination network we have behind this virtual system and this packet is designated to that particular virtual systems behind network this vsx gateway will forward that packet to that virtual system for example right now say packet one is destined for this virtual system so this vsx gateway will send that packet here and from here this virtual system will process that packet and return to the destination where it actually wanted to go the virtual system inspect all traffic and allow or reject it according to the rules defined in the security policies now let's see how physical network topology without vsx will appear so consider have a multiple internet network and those internet networks are getting protected by uh, different firewalls so how the scenario will be so this is what your cloud from where the internet connection will come then there will be your some external router from the service provider then after you have your firewalls configure so consider this is a separate firewall this is another separate firewall and this is another separate firewall all these firewalls are protecting their own separate networks so which will look like this so consider this is network 1 Network 2, Network 3. In a typical deployment with multiple security gateways, each protects a separate network. Each physical security gateway has interface to the perimeter router and to the network it protects. So if you notice for these three different networks, we need to have three different firewalls. 
and traditionally without VSX we need to purchase three different firewalls whether it's the same vendor or different vendor or maybe the three different appliances from the same vendor or different vendor the cost of the firewalling is increased here and the burden you can say or the configuration times also get increased because of the you know configuring all these firewalls set up all these firewalls and all those things this is what we get from the traditional physical network topologies without VS but if you consider the VSX option here this three firewalling functionality will be getting within one VSX gateway so this is your one VSX gateway and this one VSX gateway having these three different firewalls for example and using only one hardware, configuring only one hardware, set up only one hardware, you will be you know doing the same work what we are doing for with the topology without VSX. So this is the benefit what we get from the VSX feature of the checkpoint firewall. And this is what uh, a brief overview of the VSX. Thanks for watching this video guys and I will see you on the next video.